on? Yep. All right. Your name is? Grant. And? All right. At the world famous Sun Coast Technical College, a Haas Technical Education Center. And you're about to do what? Take a part. And what's it called? NIMS project. NIMS uh, uh, certification uh, test project. Testing. All right. So I see you have your material all set up in there. Looks like you already took a skim cut and um, ready to cut, right? Yeah. And you've already made one, so this is going to run full, full speed, paper. right? Yeah. All right. So uh, throw your chip conveyor on, by the way. Yeah. Yeah. You can put that in the program with an M31, but okay. Memory reset. We will hear some beautiful chip cutting. Go ahead. Next pass, I predict. As long as nothing hits the chunk, which we've already proven out. There we go. Sounds like hail on the window. Sounds good. Good chip breaking. Sounds like money. That's right. Let's bump the spindle speed up. 10%. Oh, another 10. Okay. We're at the low end of the surface feet per minute range. Now we're cutting 50 thou per rev at 15 thou per... I'm sorry, I, mean, I said that backwards. 50 thou per pass at 15 thou per rev. SFM of a conservative 850. And a typical setup. Did we get a cycle time in the last one? Yeah. Wasn't too long though. Looks like we're getting low on cord, by the way. Yeah. Well, we'll do it on Monday. Over the long weekend, you get a lot of water evaporation, so... But you can kind of tell it's getting thick and heavy. I don't think you need a refractometer to tell you that. No bad noises. Looks like it's taking the last skim cut of the G71. Put the optional stop on. Alright, I just want to take a look at this thing. Alright, let's see what we got here. A lot of fumage. I blow it off. Let's see, check the surface finish. Alright. Inserts in good shape. Lots of chips in there. Alright, let's. Oh! A lot of chips against the door. Okay, now let's uh, go, go for it again. Right. Just put the spindle back at 100%. I was just experimenting on the roughing speeds. This is just doing the skim cut for the finish. I know it's Friday, right? Yeah. We're here late because we want our NIM certification. You're interning now, Grant. What are you doing? CAD CAM design work. Yep. What do you use? Uh, I use MasterCAM and it's all over 16. Very good. Okay, what do we got here? Good finish. Lots of chips. That look good. Did we get the front. Double check that front. Alright. We don't want to end up with one of these. Catch that stuff while it's in the machine. Alrighty. Do we cut this off all the way? Do we cut this off all the way? Do we? Yeah. Do we? Is it fall right off? No, 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 no. What would happen if it fell off? Wouldn't look too good. Alright, so what have we decided to do? 
Okay, go ahead. Okay. You know, actually this, I don't know how other people do it, but maybe we're giving away secrets here. Well, we do not cut it off all the way. I'm going to take that off, cut off the bandsaw, and finish it on the other end. And we'll wait till he cuts it off. 